welcome back. This is Gina. I've got uh, three more entries for my friendship journal to share with you guys. So I'm going to just jump straight in. And this one has come from Australia. This is uh, Penny, Pen, Penny Marshall. Um, Penny's got a channel here on YouTube, so I will be putting that in the description box below for you guys to see. Um, so yeah, I think... Um, she was getting a little bit concerned because she had mailed this some time back, so I'm not sure, Penny, what the holdup was, but luckily it arrived, and it is absolutely gorgeous, guys. Um, she's got a metal butterfly here. Let me make sure I've got the camera out good. So she's got, you know, the paper folded in half. She's got some lace here. Uh, looks like maybe some scrapbook paper behind here. She's created a pocket. One, two, three pockets, I believe. And then there's a crocheted flower here with some trim. It is beautiful. So let's jump in and start here. Isn't this beautiful? I love this embossing folder, um, Penny. That is absolutely gorgeous. And then she's got this um, either a die or a punch that does the decorative edge. This is just gorgeous. And then she's inked around that. And then this, look at that, that's a little double heart um, altered paper clip. I love that idea, and I'm definitely going to have to give that one a try. That is beautiful. So she's got that tucked in the back there. And then look at that little paper clip. Isn't that gorgeous? So that was tucked over there. I love the way that looks. And then here we've got a window envelope with another big beautiful tag. Love that. Some um, trim up here and some washi and then she's done a fussy cut of that clock. That is beautiful, Penny. And then here, look at that. She's got the bubble, bumblebee um, die cut. That is so sweet and I love that metal um, butterfly there. So then this comes out and look at that. She's got another little window envelope that's got a tag tucked in there. Beautiful image. And then she's got some pretty trim there. That's a beautiful um, tag die as well. I always like to see what other people, um, you know, the supplies that they've got. And then this is a big tag here. So that flips over. And then she's put a little tab so that will, you know, just peek out. And then some lace there as well. So that just peeks out there. Love that. She's got some washi here. She's done sewing along the edge. Lots of work went into this. <coughs> Inside, you got a paper clip here. And then look at, she's pressed a flower there with some trim and some lace and an eyelet. I love that. And let me see. Oh, she's got, tucked in here is another little pocket. Let me see. Oh, look at that. Beautiful card. And she's got a note to me, so I will read that in a minute. And look at this. Beautiful handmade paper. That is gorgeous. I must, must get around and start trying my hand at some <coughs> handmade papers. And then this is tucked in. She's got, I love this. It's got all these little places to, to find things from. This is a little um, envelope. She's got a tiny tag in there. And that's just tucked in there. Another little secret place. This tiny paper clip. Let me get that back. Just beautiful. That image is gorgeous. And I love this trim. She's sewn all that on there. And then another beautiful, um, this is like a glassine envelope, I think. And she's got a couple of tags tucked in here. Beautiful. And then look at this. Oh, isn't that sweet? She said this is where she grew up. Beautiful. Really pretty. Thank you for adding that, um, Penny. That is gorgeous because I love that kind of stuff. It just so nice to visualize where everybody's 
<coughs> from and you know know a, a little bit more about them. So we've got both of these little tags tucked in here. I love that tag, that's beautiful. And then here she's got a little Australian stamp, I love that. And look at this, oh I love that. I keep meaning to pick up some of these uh, paint um, swatches and I, I never do think of it when I'm at the hardware store. I love that little tag, isn't that sweet? So he's just peeking out there and then look at that paper clip, that's beautiful. Okay, the paper clip goes up here. I'm going to keep the note out and read that after I've done the um, video, guys. So I'll tuck that back. And that was tucked under there. So, And then on the back here, oh, I love this. Oh, she's got a magnet in there. <clears throat> and that is beautiful. Just beautiful. Okay, so I've got a nice big writing sheet I can do some extra journaling on. I love that. And look at that. She's stitched all the way around that pocket. That is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love the magnet in there. Beautiful. Oh, I love that tag. So that's some flowers, like a sticker on a, on a um, tag. And then she's got the sari and some more of that beautiful trim along the edge there. Oh, it's beautiful, Penny. I'm so glad this did not get lost in the mail because she was very worried about this. A belly band here, and that is absolutely gorgeous because that's got several layers of the butterfly. Love that. And then this beautiful tag here is tucked under, and then she's got where she's from, Tasmania. Love it. Oh, Penny, thank you so much. I will read the card here in just a moment. The next entry, guys, comes from Jacqueline out of Puerto Rico. And um, Jacqueline, I'm sorry, I will not even attempt to try to pronounce your last name because I'm terrible with pronunciation. <laughs> and I'm so afraid I'll just mess it up. So she sent me this all wrapped up. Isn't it beautiful? And that tissue paper I can reuse, which I love. Even this paper I can reuse. Look at this. First of all, it's just like, whoa, this is amazing. So look, she's got in that a fabulous tag. Look at that. And she has stamped that. That is amps. I mean, it's a wax seal, I meant. Oh, she's got an Instagram, one of a kind underscore by Jacqueline. So I will put that in the uh, description box. You guys check her out because uh, look at all of this. Oh, I can't believe this came through. Oh, just beautiful. Look at these are all just so gorgeous because she had uh, contacted me and said you know because she lives in Puerto Rico she can <clears throat> sympathize with um, people in Europe and the United Kingdom because um, it's very difficult and very expensive to get a hold of Tim Holtz items and uh, scrapbooking things so she does a lot of upcycling and recycling in her house and oh my gosh has she got some beautiful beautiful things Jacqueline thank you so much for sharing those with me I love them and those are absolutely going to be used in the, uh, the double D stamp I do vaguely remember that when I was growing up um, actually I, was, I, I remember the S&H stamps that's what it was so yeah that's really awesome to have that look at this isn't that beautiful? Just gorgeous. Oh, I love her style. It's uh, very, very vintage. Jacqueline, this, it is gorgeous. Look at that. She's got a little metal um, charm with a bulb pin. 
I mean, the layers that she has put on there are just fabulous. Uh, she's a mixed media artist. That's why you're seeing so much layering. That is fantastic. Oh, Jacqueline, I love it. This is. I'm going to sit this out in my uh, studio because I've had a couple of ladies make me things, and um, and I, I I'm going to. I'm going to designate a, a little shelf to um, some things, so that's definitely going to go up there, Jacqueline. That is amazing. Look at this. I believe that was a wrapped around that. Oh my gosh, there's just so much to take in. Look at that. Index card. That is beautiful. Beautiful. And look at this. An envelope that she's altered. Oh my gosh. That is just amazing. Look at the stamping and the layers and stitching. It's fabulous. Just amazing. Look. The lace around that. And she's got... Oh, it's just so much. I love it. She's embossed that and attached the lace. I mean, it just... The presentation, Jacqueline, is just, I mean, that is a work of art right there. You know, everything back, I'm almost tempted just to put the whole thing on my shelf. <laughs> it is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, Jacqueline. Okay, let me sit this over, guys, so I can show you the, uh, oh, I love these, look at that. Ooh. Okay, so this is her entry, and it is beautiful. Look at that. The heart, just so much to take in. Stamping, the layering, stamping there. Just amazing. Look at that. So, I, oh, I don't want to. I'm not going to undo it. I'm just going to try to slide this off because I, I, I know I'll never get it back the way she's done it. She's got a beautiful bow there. Look at that. Ruffle. Oh, it's fantastic. Jacqueline, it is beautiful. Just beautiful. Wow. Yes, this is, uh, look at that. She stamped on the muslin. I love to touch these things. I was watching Rachel. Look, you know, she was going through hers. Look at these, just beautiful. This is why I think sometimes um, most of the, you know, the real creativity, I think, can come from um, not having a lot of store-bought things you, where you really have to, to dig into your stash and everyday items, but look at that. I mean, it's just gorgeous. So as I was saying, um, oh, this is amazing. Ra uh, Rachel was looking through some entries the other day, and she was saying, oh, I have to touch everything. I'm the same. I cannot walk through a store without my, having my hands all over um, the clothes because <laughs> I like to touch. I don't know. Look at that, and this. That must be a um, a die cut, and she's put it on there. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness! Look at that. Just beautiful. This see, it's just stuff that, because I tend to just work with the white and the black thread, and uh, I've got other threads, but I just don't ever think to get it out. But what a difference. Look at that. That's the brown. And what a difference that makes. That is just beautiful. This tag is amazing. So many layers. Um, look at that. That's one of those um, seed envelopes. It's beautiful. Just beautiful. And then look. A couple other pieces. I just love it. So pretty the way it 
<clears throat> she's got everything placed. Look at that. <laughs> I love how that just sits over the edge of that pocket. Beautiful. Okay, let me check the time, guys. Okay, so here we've got, oh, look at that tag. I love that. Very rustic, which, you know, I'm, um, I'm partial to the, I mean, I love shabby chic. I like rustic. I guess I'm kind of, you know, I'm, I, I've always put myself somewhere in between the two, and this is just beautiful. That doily. Wow. Look at that tag. It's the way she's layered everything. It's just, look at this. I mean, that's just beautiful. Let's see, she's included ledger paper, um, old music sheet, and that, but it's the way she's presented it is just so beautiful. It's a real knack um, that these ladies have got, I tell you. Love it. Oh, Jacqueline, thank you. This is just beautiful. Really, really pretty entry. And on the back here, look at this. One of a kind by Jacqueline. Just a beautiful, beautiful page. Oh, my goodness. Yes, thank you so very, very much. Let me sit that over, guys. I'm trying to keep myself organized, and I am struggling. <laughs> okay, guys, the other entry I've got is Jean Surowick. Surowick, and it's coming from Florida. Oh, Jean, thank you for that note. That is really, really sweet. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? She's got a old window frame here, and the ladies are sitting there putting their flower arrangement together. And I imagine they picked it from this garden out here. Isn't that beautiful? So Jean says she's got an eclectic um Taste and I have to say I, I think I kind of do as well, Jean. I I kind of like to mix around and I get bored with any one theme, but that is beautiful. I love that journal card and look at that tag. So she's got the tag, then layered these on there, and then the back she's got this digital and then created a pocket here that these fit into. Just beautiful. love it and she's aged all the way around here and look at in here that is gorgeous I love the way that looks because it just makes you want to explore what's happening in here that is so pretty Jean so she's got a double pocket those are beautiful fussy cuts I'll have to find out where she got those actually she's got look at three three different sections there that is gorgeous I love that little journal card. That's tucked in there. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful fussy cut. And this tag. Look at that little girl. Isn't that sweet? She's got lace. She's got the um, fussy cut rose. Then she stitched that on there. And she's aged all around that. That is beautiful. I love the way that tag looks. And that's just poking out there and this is who she is the inky owl studio so i will put this information in the description box guys you please go over, check her out she's got a youtube channel and then within that she'll have her instagram and um, shop so you guys do check her out and that's tucked in there and then look at over here she's got another one of those beautiful pockets that image is gorgeous, and I love this. It's just this tiny little book. Look at that. Little envelope with a little card. Actually, that opens up. Isn't that sweet? Oh, I love this stuff. Just gorgeous. So that's tucked in there. 
And then look at that. That's a beautiful little booklet. Gorgeous. Look at the back. Even a little bitty coin envelope. That must have been so difficult to make. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, Jean, this is absolutely gorgeous. So that is tucked in there. So I've got a lot of writing space I can do in that. And then look at this tag. Isn't that beautiful? She's got a belly band here that's multiple layers of fabrics and laces. And then she's got the little bead, um, string of bead pearls. And that image back there is gorgeous. And then look at, oh, I love that. That looks like it was either a hanky. Okay, guys, sorry about that. My battery died. Um, so we were looking at this tag. Isn't this beautiful? She's done some stitching there, some lace, and I absolutely love this pocket. And inside, she's done that gorgeous little image as a tag. So that is all tucked into the belly band here on the back. Beautiful, beautiful entry. Thank you guys so very, very much. So here are the latest entries, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you that's participated. And um, as I said before, I'm going to go ahead and, and postpone the drawing until about the 15th of April to make sure everybody's come in. Um, I think it's a fair thing to do. Anyways, guys, you guys take care. I will see you back here very soon. Bye! <music>